It's Courtney here. I'm so excited. We're here at The Real Woman, The Resilient Woman, The Expiring Woman, The Aspiring Woman, and The Laboring Woman. We are so excited. This is our fourth brunch, and we're here. We're excited. We're ready to pour out to these women. We're ready for them to pour into us. We're so excited, y'all. If you're missing this, you're missing out. We have vendors here. We have giveaways. We have great food. We're so excited because we have Pink Tops organization here that's bringing awareness. We're collecting plastic bottles while they recycle them where they're able to help women with their uh, medical needs and are able to help with trans transportation to their doctor's appointments so we're excited to be able to pour into that we have different vendors here we're giving away the giveaways ladies we're giving away free eyelashes we're giving away if you're starting a business or you're trying to start your brand we have brand consultants here you're missing out if you're not here the real one You're also able to come against those things that people said that you are and people said that you weren't. You're able to say, I'm bigger than what they said. I am not this. I am not that. I'm here today to gain wisdom on how to become a better woman and to um, learn from more experienced women because I'm just starting off um, knowing who I am and what I'm about. And so I'm definitely here to learn, you know, more about what I could become and everything that they have to offer. I'm willing to listen and to learn from it. Friends hurt me. The family. to come to a place where it was just me and God. I knew that <clears throat> what he was doing was separating, well, I, I realized after the fact that he was separating from distractions and people that were leeches and just wanted to be around me for their personal gain. Seems like I've had all I can take One more thing And I might break But I Unwavering love. It's a unforgiving. Uh, it's a forgiving love. It's an unchanging love. You know the type of love that God gives a man to be able to love you is because he's chasing after God because he knows that that's what your heart is. Your whole life is going to be ups and downs. It's not what you're going through. It's how you come out of it. When you are the peace and you are the love and you're the light, when you when you walk in those steps, you leave imprints behind you. And when a person falls in your step, they're falling in those things that you left behind you. What did you leave behind? Did you leave behind love? Did you leave behind the word of God? Did you leave behind the, the spirit in, in your favor, the things that you have allowed people to, to grasp upon you? You leave those deep imprints. And when people fall in those, you want them to have something that was left that's for good, not for bad. God, we ask that you give them strength, you give them courage, you make them who they are. I am. I am strong. I am bold. I am you. I am me. I am Shantae Renee. Thank you, God, for bringing this, this gift together, this vision together. Bless each and every one of you on your journey home. In your name that I pray, amen. 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 amazing I'm so proud of Courtney um, the most that I got out of today was endurance um, no matter what fight you're fighting no matter what battle you're facing 
always, you always can endure, you always can succeed, you always can do that dream that you want to do. Just stay focused, stay positive, plant good seeds so good seeds can come back to you. Um, today was just an amazing event. Thank you so much. My labor is not in vain. Um, as they mentioned, the laboring woman, I'm in that phase of my life now, so I'm learning to trust God and just let Him work and do things inside of me during the season of my life and that everything that I'm going through will help manifest the blessings that He has for me. Aspire to inspire. Just continue to push, um, praying until something happens. Not only just praying, but putting in that action and that work at the same time. The real woman. Before I came, I was struggling with um, following my dreams and letting go of situations that are in my life. But when coming, uh, it showed me that anything's possible. I can follow my dreams. I can do whatever, whatever I would like to do if, as long as I have faith in God. So.